My vision for child health in Ghana is to tremendously reduce the child mortality rates, if possible, to zero level. I think we don't want to see our children dying out of diseases. We don't want to see our children dying out of birth injuries. I believe that the pediatric um, nursing program that is being sponsored uh, by CEDA and the Sick Kids Hospital in Toronto is a very laudable venture and that would help us significantly in achieving our vision for child health care in Ghana. We need to increase our numbers and we need to get to the root of the matter to help reduce the mortality and the mobility rates associated with malaria, beta asphyxia, neonatal infections, diarrheal diseases, and all other forms of communicable diseases. And we want the pediatric nurses to also be in the labor wards so that when a, a mother gives birth to a baby, the midwife has a, what, a pediatric nurse available to help resuscitate babies so that babies will be free from these complications of asphyxia and all that. It breaks your heart when you're working around children, you don't feel comfortable because your, your knowledge base is, 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 is limited and, 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 and makes work unpleasant, you know. You don't feel competent. So typically if you enter into a clinical area where nurses are not supposed to enter veins and the child is having diarrhea and vomiting, there's no doctor, the pediatric nurse now can set up IVs. So we're actually going to save a lot of lives. I think that if we have enough pediatric nurses in the communities, they would actually play a key role in giving mothers the best of care by way of health education. So the mothers will, will receive education. I think we now have the skills and the knowledge so we can help the mothers focus on preventive health care. We teach children how to wash their hands often, how to wash their fruits before eating, how to eat the best kind of food, get, eating warm food and all that, so that the children themselves will have control of their own health. So everybody in Ghana wants children to be healthy. We are putting in systems and processes to make sure this happens because uh, we know it will not happen by, 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 by miracle. And that also means that we have to partner. Now I think uh, interacting with sick kids and for this program for pediatric nursing in the School of uh, Nursing at Legon uh, is not only timely, but it is appropriate and uh, it's welcoming and heartwarming. This program actually has um, gotten us equipped for, 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 for the future, you know. We want to make sure when we go back to, on the wards, we, we, we inform people, our, our fellow colleagues as nurses, and we make sure we, we, we inspire change. So we, 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 are, we are so op op optimistic about bringing a change in pediatric healthcare. The time is now. No child should die. Every child has the right to live to the highest potential. We're looking forward to that day mm -hmm. when we would have a pediatric nurse in every hospital in Ghana, yeah. in every district hospital, yes. in every community clinic. And all children will be smiling in Ghana. Smiling. <laughs> all the children will be smiling. <laughs> la, la, la.